Oh shit. <laughs> Well, hello there, goat man. Time to eat my brains. Hello, everybody. This is Uppish, and welcome to Do You Copy? <laughs> In this game, you play as a uh, forest ranger in a watchtower, and generally the goal is to find a way to save the hiker in the woods being stalked by something lurking out there in the trees and in the dark. So yeah, we played this a long, 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 long time ago. Long time ago. At the time, well, it was shitty. <laughs> so, I decided that today I'm going to come back to the game just so that we can play it properly, get all the endings in one video, and hopefully everything goes nice. So yeah, without further ado, let us begin. Do you copy? Ooh. Look at these. This is actually kind of pretty sight. Pretty well done. The watchtower out in the distance. Uh, examine bulletin board. Bulletin board? What? What? Bu oh, oh, bulletin board. Uh, is there a light I can turn on? No. Hmm. Huh. Okay then. Tower four. This is tower two. Hourly radio check. Over. Yes. Is everybody? Come in, tower four. Do you copy? Over. Yeah, sure. Tower 2, this is Tower 4. I copy, over. Good to hear, Tower 4. Kicking off for the night. Park's all yours. Over. Oh, you've gotta be kidding me. Who the hell just runs away? Who the <laughs> You don't just turn in for the night like that, I don't think. That's weird. Like, how far do you have to go? To, like, every night? <laughs> That's weird. Uh... Hello? Hello? Is anyone there? Yeah, I'm here. The hell are you getting onto the radio for? Has copy, this is Fire Tower 4 over. I, I, I saw this channel listed on one of the trails out here. I need you to help me. Something... I'm lost and something is chasing me. Please, you have to help me. Okay, that's worrying. What do you mean? Uh, calm down. You need to stay calm. Where are you? Over. I don't know. Something started chasing me, so I started running. You have to help me. I'm going to die out here. Well, then, if you think you're gonna die, then shut the fuck up. What do you do when you think a bear is outside your tent? You shut the fuck up. Or, better yet, you hop up, and you holler, you puff your chest up, you stuff out the damn thing, the, the damn damn, uh, the, 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 the tent, and you make a hoot and holler. I'll turn on the floodlights over. Well, shit. I was too slow. <laughs> Oopsie. Missing another hiker lost in Greystone Park. Tragedy has once again struck in Greystone Park as another visitor goes missing. The Greystone Park service is heavy shooting official statement. The vigil was was the victim of, of a bear attack and that some of his personal effects were collected at Greystone Park. Okay, then. Oops. I, <laughs> let's try that again. I didn't mean to do that. I didn't. I, I just took, apparently I took too long. Didn't know I could take too long. Come on, man. Okay, that's better. Uh, yeah. Let's go ahead and just check on this for now. I turned up the gamma. Just so that, uh, let's see. Gracewind Herald, fourth hiker missing. 
the goat man. Weird. That doesn't look like a goat to me. What? The, what is that? The, the lame thing? Oh, the same thing. That doesn't look like a goat, look like a goat to me. Notice all personnel. Milford and the Gracewind Lake Pass is off limits to all park visitors due to multiple reports of bears. Uh, I'll turn on the floodlights. All right, we need to move. It sucks we can't run. All right, did I do right? I hope I did. <laughs> hmm. Okay, yeah. So this guy's being chased. Look, I, I don't know what happened back there. I, I was just uh, camping, you know, a solo hike, just a day or two to myself. I, this was such a mistake. Got fresh air, or run. Yeah, lots of good that did me. I'm, I'm sorry, I'm... Just rambling at you. Just trying to keep my head busy, you know? I'll let you get back to you know, whatever you do. Uh-huh. Uh, okay. The reason why I put a pit on the map was because, uh, well, well, you guys should know what this map is. If you've seen the last gameplay of this I made so many damn years ago, uh, basically, I'm pretty sure that the first, that he's gonna eventually hit this junction. Uh, let's have him go straight. Take the left path. Are we in Tower 1 or Tower 2? I'm pretty sure we're Tower 1, right? Okay, so now that he's gone here... Well, now that he's taken the left path, he's gone this way. Which means he'll have to go this way. Which means we either lead him to us, or we lead him away. But I'm pretty sure... I don't like that. I don't like that. I don't like that. Hello? I don't copy. Could you repeat over? I don't like it. I don't. This. <laughs> I'm not going to lead him to the tower. To our tower. Well, well. Should we leave him, lead him to our tower? You know what? No. Well, actually, we're going to lead him to our tower. Might as well. Just to get one of the endings. What was that? Did you hear that? Uh huh. Uh huh. No, no, no. Did you hear that? That is not inspiring. Did you see that? No, no, I didn't. Uh, what do you see? Any landmarks? I think I see a lake and a cave, a mine, something like that. He's probably right about here. Uh, head towards the lake. It'll pull you back on the trail over. doubt you're gonna be getting out of this situation buddy boy I really do 
I don't believe he's going to get out. Oh, that's just fucking creepy. Oh my... How fast can this damn thing travel? Not so bad though. Uh, I wouldn't be in this situation. I don't like that. I don't like. I don't like. I don't like it. I don't like it. I don't like it. Okay, he should end up right about here. Hopefully, if I let him in the right direction, which means I can either have him. Go to tower two, or follow the path over here and turn to the to our tower. All right. All right. Uh, looks like I'm getting onto uh, Gracewind Lake Pass. This. Uh, how much longer till I'm over here? Just keep on that trail, and it could take you right to the tower. It should take All you right to the tower. See you soon, then. See what? See what? Hello? Hello? See you soon. Here. Wait, what? 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 We're gonna leave him with a story and he's very good missing. Uh, what the fuck? What just happened? I'm confused. Okay, then I just waste all that freaking time. Son of a bitch. We're gonna do this. We're gonna, uh, gonna go for the next ending, I guess, because we just fucking failed to get him into either of the damn towers. <laughs> if we lead him over here. Okay, he's gonna. He's gonna end up right about. Right about here. Then he'll go here. He'll get chased there. And then we're gonna lead him here to the mining tunnels for an ending. I think I do remember there being an ending here. Let's see, head up to the path of the left. You, uh, can get my feeling that, uh, somebody's watching you. It's there, it's there with him. Yeah. It's, uh, apparently I'm wrong. Apparently. Apparently, he went, where the hell did he go? He went, no, he went. Mm, I'm confused. Uh, did he go this way? I should still be leading him to the tunnels. Hello. Oh. No thank you.
thank you. I'm not going to do that. No. no, thank you. Because it's not likely that you're still... I'm not turning on those damn breakers. I know that's what he wants. It wants. I'm not doing that. Thank you. What? Ah. Maybe I was wrong. Biker chased by a wild animal. Park services were shocked this morning to discover a man trespassing in Greasewood State Park. After coaxing the man down from the local fire tower, local authorities were able to determine that he had been able he'd been led there by a park ranger to escape from a wild animal. The park ranger responsible for helping the man has declined to comment. Huh. Awesome. So I unintentionally actually led him towards the tower. Shit. Oh well, at least we got one of the endings. So yeah, on to the next ending. Up left path, keep on the straight shot to me. Keep on the path, head off this path to the left. Uh. Hey, you uh. Think I have a feeling that uh somebody's watching you. Did I just click on the the no, same one I clicked the last time? I'm just being paranoid. Or. So does that mean he went over here again? Another hiker. Well, hell. Son of a gun. I didn't mean to do that again. I... It got close. I got close that time. Uh... What did I do? It. Well, at least I got a different dialogue. This is difficult. <laughs> Uh, am I leading him in the right direction? I'm guessing he pa passed. Yeah, either passed the past or went down here to the bottom of the lake. Down here by Paradise Trail. I'm hoping he went by Paradise Trail so I could, I don't know, turn on the damn floodlights and lead him here. I remember in the last gameplay that turning on the light on the floodlights at some point led him here to, the, to this to this tower. Oh. This, uh, how much longer till I'm over here? So, right or left? Let's have him go. Uh, turn off and take the secondary trail a bit further ahead. Uh, yeah, sure. What is it? Like, bears or something? Yeah, bears. <laughs> Yeah, sure. It is time to turn on the floodlights. Any minute. Oh shit. <laughs> Well, hello there, goat man. Time to eat my brains. 
Ration monster trucks again. Two fresh disappearances at Great Wood Raceway Park have stirred up discussions around the park's oldest urban legend. Following the unexpected vanishing of a park ranger and a local hiker, many have begun to place the blame on the mythical, on the mythical Gracewind Goatman. Uh, rooted in the strange testimony given during the trial of Michael Leeds, many believe the Goatman to be a malevolent entity with the ability to mimic voices of those lost in the woods. Of course, despite many anecdotes, no actual evidence of the creature has ever been found. Park services are often uh, officially ruling the disappearances as animal attacks. Why ain't that bullcrap? <laughs> Anyways, guys, I'm gonna end this here. Thank you all for watching, however many of you actually are watching. It was great to look back on this old game. This game is a good, a good bunch of years old. And back when I first played it, anybody that actually watched that old gameplay knows that at the time, uh... I could barely even play the game on its lowest graphics settings, which looks like shit. So, uh, I decided to play it for the second time ever, just so I could get the full, the full experience, the full experience, no issues, and that's what I got, and it was awesome. A far better experience, in my honest opinion. So yeah, let me know your thoughts. Did the did, did the Grace Men go get yeah. Did the Grace Wind Goat Man creep you out? Did it scare you? Did you did it have you quivering? Eh, it kind it didn't really creep me at all too much. It had its it had its moments. The game is charming. This game is charming. I hope. One day they make a similar game, which I looked around and apparently they were planning to make uh, another game set in the same universe as Do You Copy. However, they've gone on hiatus and haven't said much for a while, so I don't know when that's happening. Hopefully when that does happen, we'll be able to check it out. Whether that's only if it actually comes out for free or not, or if it comes out on Steam. I'll definitely pay for it if it's on Steam, but I just don't have the accounts to be paying for it on Game Jolt. <laughs> so yeah, thank you all, and without further ado, I'll see you all in the next video. Bye bye